100 Artists 100 Days Retro Challenge and today is Bill Watterson. Also known as the JD Salinger of the newspaper strips, he made over 3000 Calvin and Hobbes strips, a black and white one every weekday and a color one on Sundays. They were funny for kids, funny for adults, everybody loved them. But then the businessman came knocking to make Calvin and Hobbes goods and he was kind of disgusted and uh, called it a day and he became a recluse, kind of like JD Salinger after the catcher in the ride. I'm very familiar with the style after reading it my whole life. They're still printing reruns these days. So kind of Simpsons type bulbous noses, little circles for the eyes, four huge fingers, gummy bodies, and just a joyous swing to all the lines. He has a very loose inking style. Everybody knows Watterson inked with a Winsor & Newton Series 7 number one. So that's what I'm gonna do. But uh, yeah, you know what happens with those? This. I don't really know why this happens, but it seems to happen when the brush is not brand new. But trying it again, because when it does work, it's so fun. And the lines are just alive. Those little mistakes, they just bring character to the drawing. So I'll just fix the mistakes later in Photoshop. Add some gray rasters and boom, Calvin's dad on his midlife crisis motorcycle. <laughs> I like it. I need me a midlife crisis motorcycle. Still open for requests, so drop the names of artists you want me to give a go at. Thumbs up if you like this drawing and see you tomorrow.